Welcome to another edition of the Montalvo Web Tension Control Technical Training Series. Each one of these videos is designed to assist you in using and taking full advantage of all the benefits your Montalvo components have to offer. In this edition, we'll be covering general information about the Montalvo MPC4 IP converter and go through the calibration process. One of the first and most important things to do when installing a new Montalvo tension control system or troubleshooting an existing one is to check that the IP converter is properly installed and calibrated. Let's get started by going over some general information. The first item to cover is that for best results, it's recommended to mount the IP converter as close as practical to the brake or clutch assembly that you're using with it. Long tubing runs, large volume requirements, and restrictions such as valves or fittings can delay the response time of the system to changes in air pressure. Item two, the IP converter should be mounted in a vertical position and then calibration done at the installed location. The next item is a warning to not turn any screws on the IP converter except the zero screw and the span screw. And don't disassemble this unit in the field or reverse the air lines between the input and output connectors. Doing any of these things can result in damage to the unit and require that it be returned to the factory for repair or replacement. Item 4. Calibration should be repeated whenever a problem occurs with your tension control system. And you should also recalibrate on a periodic basis. You should be good if you do this once every six months as a preventative measure. Next, we recommend that the plant air going to the IP converter should be set at 80 to 85 PSI. And for the last item, dry clean air is important for operation of the IP converter and also helps to extend its life. If you're not able to ensure that you're supplying clean dry air to this unit, we recommend you also purchase our MAF3 air filter. This unit provides a 5 micron water filter and a 0.3 micron oil separating filter. Now that we've covered these general information items, let's move into the calibration procedure. For this process, I will be following the instructions from our S4 controller manual. These steps are very similar to the steps you'll follow when using the IP converter with our Z4 and U4 controllers. Step one, put the controller into manual mode. To do this, press the tension on off button so the tension LED is solid and the only LED lit. You may have to press the tension button multiple times to accomplish this. At this point, the message man out should show on the display. If not, press the up or down arrow until it does. Adjust this setting to zero using the keypad. If you're using a controller board without an HMI, you'll need additional instructions to put the controller into the manual mode. Please call Montalvo Technical Support for these instructions. Step two, remove the air tubing from the output fitting on the front of the IP converter. There shouldn't be any air coming out of this fitting. If there is, turn the zero screw until you feel the air turn off. If there is no air coming out, turn the zero screw until you feel air start to come out. Then turn back the other direction until it stops. With this done, you can plug the air tubing back into the output fitting. 
Step three, with the controller still displaying the man out message, adjust the display to show 75 PSI. Turn the span adjustment screw on the front of the IP converter until the output gauge also reads 75 PSI. It's best to use our IP converters that come with an air gauge pre-installed. If the unit you're working with doesn't have this, you'll need to temporarily install a gauge in the airline on the output side of the IP converter. Step four, repeat steps two and three until you're confident the zero and span settings are accurate in relation to each other. Making changes to one setting can affect the other. We always ship out instructions with each one of our products, but if you no longer have the originals, then you can find the instructions and data sheets for the MPC4 or any of our products on our website at www.montalvo.com in the product section. If you need additional information, please call our customer service line at 1-800-226-8710. For our international customers, there will be a list of numbers for you to contact at the end of this video. Well, that's all for this episode. It's time for me to grab my tools and get ready to head out on a service call. And that brings up one last item. Montavo not only provides the best remote technical support in the industry, but we also offer on-site technical support at your facility. If you would like information on scheduling on-site assistance for installation, repairs, or fine-tuning of your web tension control systems, please contact us. Thanks again for watching this episode, and I look forward to having you join us for another video in this series soon.